Measurement is the basis for everything we do. It's the basis for whether a part stays or whether it's replaced, knowing what size it is, knowing whether a fuel system is flowing enough fuel or too much or too little. So it's really something that we use every day in automotive repair. We're gonna show you the fundamentals of each tool how to adjust them, how to set a zero so you can take an accurate measurement. So the first thing that we want to do with this is we want to bring the micrometer in until it seats and the ratchet clicks. Each tool is featured in a video lesson, so the video lesson allows you to pause on something or go back if you didn't quite hear something. You can review it as many times as you need. I also give some examples of how I would use it and how I would take specific measurements. 0.178 will slide in and feels nice and smooth. You don't need a lot of math at this point to use measuring equipment. You can use a calculator. It's more important to get accurate measurements than worrying about doing simple math. 0.5 millimeters. That means that whatever this hole finishes at, this part has to be plus 0 0.05 millimeters bigger than the hole. We're going to show you how to use each tool. We're going to show you what tool to use and when to use it, whether or not it's the right tool for the job. Stuff like that that can help you make the decision as to what tools you are going to buy depending on the job you're doing. Practice. Keep practicing with your tools. Keep measuring things that have known dimensions that you can take those measurements and know whether you are getting the correct measurement or not. 